Hello everybody, this is Les Taylor of lestaylorphoto.com and today I'm coming to you with another photography quick tip. And in this video what I want to do is show you how to make a very simple color adjustment to your image. Now this is an image I took just about a week or so ago down on the Meguro River in Tokyo. It's a beautiful place during cherry blossom season. Definitely recommend checking it out, especially if you're here during that season. But anyway, I, I like this photo, except there's one thing I really don't like, which is I feel like there's a little bit of a yellowish kind of hue to it, especially around the cherry blossom trees themselves. And the cherry blossom trees, one of the beautiful things about them is, especially as they start blooming, they're very white, and they have a very light pinkish hue to them as well. And I feel like that yellowish tint or whatever is kind of undoing that color. And so what I want to do is try to take that away um, in a nice way. And there's a lot of different ways that you can do this. There's a lot of different approaches to it. But one really simple way is by adjusting the color balance. And so a really quick and simple way that you can adjust the color balance is by going down here. And if you see this little half light, half dark circle, you click on that. And this is going to allow you to create a new adjustment layer. There's a lot of different options here, but we're going to go to the color balance. And what this will do is this will create another layer, as you see here, um, just for adjusting the color balance, okay? And so uh, the interesting thing about this as well is that it adjusts these colors according to shadows, midtones, and highlights. So there's a lot of smaller adjustments you can do even within um, this uh, little box here. But right now we'll stick with the midtones, and I'm going to move the yellow area towards the blue here. I'm not going to do it too strong. Maybe we'll just leave it about 8, and then we'll move away from the red a little bit here. Okay, and that's in the midtones. So now let's try the highlights as well. Do kind of the similar thing there. Move it up to about seven or so, somewhere like that, and do the a little further away from the reds again. Okay, and so if I go before, I take turn this layer off or uh, basically make it invisible. You can see the kind of yellowish, especially in the trees. But as I click this back on, it undoes that a bit, and I really like uh, the feeling a little bit more gives it a lot nicer feel to uh, the image I think. Now one of the nice things about using an adjustment layer as well is that you can adjust the opacity on the on the layer. So let's say I feel like I went a little bit too strong, well I can move it down some. You can move it all the way down and obviously it'd be kind of silly to have it at 0%, but um, you can move it maybe say up to like 75%, okay? And uh, if I turn that layer off, again you can see the effect it has on the image. And this is a very powerful tool. There's a lot of different things you can do with these adjustment layers, but I hope that this has given you a quick idea of how to use it to adjust the colors in your image. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. This is Les Taylor of lestaylorphoto.com. See you next time. Bye-bye.